Evening Prayer for Wednesday in Week 6 of Easter God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. Psalmody, Antiphon 1. Do not let your hearts be troubled. Have faith in me. Alleluia. In God alone is my soul at rest. My help comes from him. He alone is my rock, my stronghold, my fortress. I stand firm. How long will you all attack one man to break him down, as though he were a tottering wall or a tumbling fence? Their plan is only to destroy. They take pleasure in lies. With their mouth they utter blessing, but in their heart they curse. In God alone be at rest, my soul, for my hope comes from him. He alone is my rock, my stronghold, my fortress. I stand firm. In God is my safety and glory, the rock of my strength. Take refuge in God, all you people. Trust him at all times. Pour out your hearts before him, for God is our refuge. Common folk are only a breath. Great man, an illusion. Placed in the scales, they rise. They weigh less than a breath. Do not put your trust in oppression, nor vain hopes on plunder. Do not set your heart on riches, even when they increase. For God has said only one thing, only two do I know, that to God alone belongs power, and to you, Lord, love and that you repay each man according to his deeds. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord God, you reward each one according to his works. Hear us as we pour out our hearts to you, seeking your grace and secure protection. We look to you for our stable hope, in a constantly changing world. Do not, not let your, your hearts, hearts be troubled. troubled. Have, Have faith, faith in me. me. Alleluia. Let the peoples praise you, Lord God. Let them rejoice in your salvation. Alleluia. O God, be gracious and bless us, and let your face shed its light upon us. So will your ways be known upon earth, and all nations learn your saving help. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. Let the nations be glad and exult, for you rule the world with justice. With fairness you rule the peoples. You guide the nations on earth. Let the peoples praise you, O God. Let all the peoples praise you. The earth has yielded its fruit, for God, our God, has blessed us. May God still give us his blessing till the ends of the earth revere him. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Be gracious and bless us, Lord, and let your face shed its light on us, so that we can make you known with reverence, and bring forth a harvest of justice. Let the, the peoples, peoples praise, praise you, Lord, Lord God. God. Let, Let them, them rejoice, rejoice in your, your salvation. salvation. Alleluia. His glory covers the heavens, and his praise fills the earth. Alleluia. Let us give thanks to the Father for having made you worthy to share the lot of the saints in light. He rescued us from the power of darkness and brought us into the kingdom of his beloved Son. Through him we have redemption, the forgiveness of our sins. He is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of all creatures. In him everything in heaven and on earth was created, things visible and invisible. All were created through him, all were created for him, he is before all else that is. In him everything continues in being. It is he who is head of the body, the church. He who is the beginning, the firstborn of the dead, 
so that primacy may be his in everything. It pleased God to make absolute fullness reside in him, and by means of him to reconcile everything in his person, both on earth and in the heavens, making peace through the blood of his cross. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. His glory covers the heavens, and his praise fills the earth. Alleluia. The reading is from a letter to the Hebrews. Jesus, because he remains forever, has a priesthood that does not pass away. Therefore, he is always able to save those who approach God through him, since he forever lives to make intercession for them. It was fitting that we should have such a high priest, holy, innocent, undefiled, separated from sinners, higher than the heavens. Unlike the other high priests, he has no need to offer sacrifice day after day for his own sins and then for those of the people. He did that once for all, when he offered himself. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. When they saw the risen Lord, Alleluia, Alleluia. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. Canticle of Mary the Antiphon, the Spirit will glorify me, for he will proclaim to you all that he has received from me. Alleluia. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him, in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Spirit will glorify me, for he will proclaim to you all that he has received from me. Alleluia. Intercessions. In his Son, risen from the dead, God has opened for us the way to everlasting life. Let us ask the Father. Through, Through the, the victory, victory of Christ, Christ save, save the people he has redeemed. God of our fathers, you raised your Son, Jesus, from the dead and clothed him in glory. Move our hearts to complete repentance. That we may walk in newness of life. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. You have led us back to the shepherd and bishop of our souls. Keep us faithful under the guidance of the shepherds of the church. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. You chose the first fruits of Christ's disciples from the Jewish people. Reveal to the children of Israel the fulfillment of the promise made to their forefathers. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. Remember the lonely, the orphaned, and the widowed. And do not abandon those who have been reconciled with you by the death of your Son. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. You called Stephen to your presence when he bore witness to Jesus, standing at your right hand. Welcome our deceased brothers and sisters who in faith and love hoped for the vision of your glory. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed, and for the happy repose of the souls of all the faithful departed, we pray. 
through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. And for the intentions in the Immaculate Heart of Mary, we pray, through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. And for whoever or whatever should we pray. For the healing in body, mind, and spirit of Father Dobbins, Father Tran, and Deacon Steve, we pray. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. And for the intentions we hold within the silence of our hearts, Let us pray. Through the victory of Christ, save the people he has redeemed. And now let us pray as Christ the Lord taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. And give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. Grant, we pray, O Lord, that as we celebrate in mystery the solemnities of your Son's resurrection, so too we may be worthy to rejoice at his coming with all the saints. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Night prayer for Wednesday in the season of Easter. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. Examination of conscience. We are called to have a clear conscience toward God and toward men in our hearts and in our minds, in our actions and inactions. To do so, it is vital that we examine our conscience daily and to ask for God's mercy as we fall short and to ask for his strength to do better. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore I ask Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. Psalmody Antiphon 1 Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. In you, O Lord, I take refuge. Never let me be put to shame. In your justice set me free. Hear me and speedily rescue me. Be a rock of refuge for me, a mighty stronghold to save me. For you are my rock, my stronghold. In your name's sake, lead me and guide me. Release me from the snares they have hidden, for you are my refuge, Lord. Into your hands I commend my spirit. It is you who will redeem me, Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Out of the depths I cry to you, O Lord. Lord, hear my voice. O let your ears be attentive to the voice of my pleading. If you, O Lord, should mark our guilt, Lord, who would survive? But with you is found forgiveness. For this we revere you. My soul is waiting for the Lord. I count on his word. My soul is longing for the Lord, more than watchmen for daybreak. Let the watchman count on daybreak, and Israel on the Lord. Because with the Lord there is mercy, and fullness of redemption. Israel indeed he will redeem from all its iniquity. 
Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Alleluia. The reading is from a letter to the Ephesians. If you are angry, let it be without sin. The sun must not go down on your wrath. Do not give the devil a chance to work on you. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. You have redeemed us, Lord God of truth. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. Gospel Canticle, the Antiphon. Protect us, Lord, as we stay awake. Watch over us as we sleep, that awake we may keep watch with Christ and asleep rest in his peace. Lord, Lord now you let, let your servant go in peace. peace. Your, your word has, has been fulfilled. fulfilled. My, My own, own eyes have seen the salvation, salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Protect us, Lord, as we stay awake. Watch over us as we sleep, that awake we may keep watch with Christ, and asleep rest in his peace. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you have given your followers an example of gentleness and humility, a task that is easy, a burden that is light. Accept the prayers and work of this day, and give us the rest that will strengthen us to render more faithful service to you, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. And may the blessing of Almighty God, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, come down upon you and remain with you forever. Amen. Amen. The Antiphon in honor of the Blessed Virgin Mary. Hail, Hail Mary, Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed, blessed are you among women, women and blessed, blessed is the fruit of your womb, womb Jesus. Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. death. Amen. Amen.